I've received this question on several of my other blind install videos, and that is with cordless blinds, sometimes you'll get an uneven extension of the blind, and you want to know how to fix that. The nice thing is, actually no tools are needed, and it's a pretty quick fix. I'm sure there's some blinds out there that actually do have a higher end head rail, and they have adjustment built in, or maybe some people tell you to actually adjust like you're going to shorten the blind, so to take some of that string out and make it more taut on one side and loose on the other. I haven't found that to be the case. These are one inch mini blinds from Lowe's. This also works on two and a half inch faux wood blinds from Home Depot, so it should work on most mini blinds out there. So let's jump in and show you how to quickly adjust it so you can get your blind back to level. All right, so I use almost a teeter-totter like motion to fix this blind, believe it or not. What does that even mean? I'll just demo it here for you. So with a torpedo level, I'll show you where level should be compared to where it is now. Looking at that center bubble, I would need to be about right here to be level. So we got a little ways to go. So let me show you what that teeter-totter means going back and forth. So this side either needs to be extended or this side needs to be shortened to get this to balance out. So what I do is I'll, I'll pull down on this side and slightly lift up on this side. So I'll retract it up and then pull down. All right, let's see what we got now. I mean, that is right on. Now you might not get it on the first try like that. So you can, you can do multiple iterations, you can retract it back up and do that kind of teeter-totter motion. Remember on the short side, you need to kind of do that aggressive pull down while kind of lifting up on the side that's a little bit too long. And then that should start to balance it out. Now you might go too far the one way and then you just reverse the process. So I know it seems like a little bit of a hack, but it works and I've straightened out many blinds that were having that issue. And I know throughout my comments that many other people have similar issues. Now, if you have a better fix, let me know. And then for the rest of you, look down in the comments and in a pinned comment at the top, I will collect any other advice that people have that works and put it there. So this is how, how I do it. I'm sure there's other ways to do it. And so I'll bring that in from all the comments so you can get that additional value as well. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel as we have multiple videos coming out per week to help you with repairs and improvements around the house. And we'll catch you on the next one. Take care.